Hey guys, Spencer Kaufman here. Today I'm going to show you how to remove your personal information from the public record database, Nuber. Alright, so the first thing you do is go to nuber.com. That's N U W B E R. Kind of weird, but nuber.com. And then there are two ways that you can remove your information. So they make it pretty, pretty good. It's kind of convenient. First thing you can do is scroll all the way down to the bottom. And there's a link here that says remove from directory. So if you click on that, it goes to a page called nuber.com slash removal slash link. And all you need to do is paste your profile link and hit submit. Bam, you're opted out. How do you find your profile link? Well, you need to search. So let's search Spencer Kaufman. We're not going to put in a city state. We're going to click search, and here we go. It doesn't appear that I am listed on here. So all we need to do then, we're going to choose this guy. He's in Decanter, Illinois, Portage PI. There's his landline. Well, Portage Place, not an I. It looks the same right there, doesn't it? P I. I L, but apparently that's an L, even though that looks like an L. Minor deal. But you see right here it says opt out. So you could click on this, and then that will bring you to the same page. However, your URL will be automatically placed in there. If not, if you didn't want to do that, you can just click Command or Control C and paste it in here yourself. Then what you're going to do is click submit and look at this, your email. So right here is where you would put your fake email. So I would put Spencer Kaufman at armyspy.com. Click I am not a robot. you got to go through this, the storefronts. Looks like all of them. Verify, check mark, remove. Okay, it says my email is invalid. So that'll give you a little alert. You must use a real email address. So good thing that you have created an email to use specifically for this or a spam email. Yeah, so it's an invalid. So they won't take any of these fake emails. So you're going to need to use a real one, which is fine. You made one when you did a different opt-out at my life so that's important to note but take any email in there put it in they'll send you a message with an opt-out link click that link and you will be removed I am not going to proceed with this even if if that email worked I wouldn't click that opt-out link because as you know this isn't my information so I'm not going to remove that but that's all you need to do enter in an email they'll send you a link click on the link and you'll be removed it's just like all of the other ones not all but most of the other places that we have done all right so if you have any questions on that or need any help be sure to put a comment in the below this video also in the description below i'll have links for this i'll have this removal link in there so that you can just click on that and then you'll also find your own listing and proceed but yeah the links will be down there while you're down there make sure to click the subscribe button also, that little bell icon to be notified when I post new videos. I'd really love that. It would really help me out. Use those social media share icons as well because you need to share this with your friends, your family, and the people you care about so that they can remove their personal information as well and protect their identities. Until next time.